In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to set up AutoCAD for landscape design. And the benefits to this is you're only learning what you need to know within the program, but ensuring that you're drawing with precision and accuracy. So when you first open up AutoCAD, this is what you will see. You can open a drawing, you can create a new drawing. They have a recent tab where it shows the recent documents that you're working with a learning section which they don't have landscape tutorials and if you're interested in landscape tutorials go to www.thelandscapelibrary.com we offer AutoCAD training for landscape design but in this tutorial I'm going to show you how to set up a new drawing when you create a new drawing you're going to see a typical screen like this this top section are tool assets where you have almost think of it like a word document you have your file edit save up in these top drop downs but you also have your tool bar with all the different commands located right here and in AutoCAD this is where you draw your landscape plan this is sort of like an infinite screen where you can draw different scales whether it's a master plan or even just a small little patio in the backyard and down here controls uh, your paper space tab so when you want to export your drawing uh, on paper this is where you're going to be working on paper drawings and then these are the different commands that relate to the mouse and the actual interface itself, like locking it in ortho mode or toggling your snap cursor. While it might seem complex, I'm actually gonna eliminate most of this program so you can only concentrate on what you need to know for landscape design. And that is sticking with the home tab right here. Most of your time, you're going to be in this home tab, possibly insert tab and annotate tab but eliminate the rest of these. You do not need to work with these, so just concentrate on home. The next biggest thing is understanding the units that you're drawing in, so you wanna create accurate landscape plans. And to do that, we're gonna type in units anywhere in the screen and press enter. A box like this will appear where it's telling me that the AutoCAD is in decimal. I prefer to work in architectural, so we're gonna change it to architectural. We can change the precision to very precise or just zero feet, zero inches. So it's just gonna round it to the nearest inch. And in landscape, we don't need to be super precise. So I stick with zero feet, zero inches. And I typically like to draw in feet rather than inches. So I'm going to put this drawing in feet. Now, when I begin to draw using the line command, I can now type in 14 feet and the line is automatically 14 feet. For more trainings or resources, go to thelandscapelibrary.com or subscribe now for more videos.